Good evening. How are you? I hope you are well. My name is Papa Martins. I want to share with you on what I've called Fight the Good Fight. Life is warfare and in a war there are many battles. Some battles you win, some you lose. Losing or winning a battle in a warfare is not the end of the war. Understanding this will help you focus as you fight your way to victory in life. All great achievers in life understand this principle. The truth is, no one who has achieved greatness in life had it easy. Just as you are struggling today, they struggled too. Just as you feel like giving up, they felt that way too, but they never gave up. They defied the urge to give up. They endured and pay the price of greatness. They focus and persevere in the face of hopelessness and discouragement. They conquered and overcame because they never gave up. And for you to overcome, that is the way to go in life. You cannot give up. You have to fight a good fight. Don't give up to, don't give in to discouragement because it destroys, it weakens, it frustrates your pursuit of success. Don't give in to distraction. It will only make you lose your focus. Don't succumb to frustration from your enemy. It will only steal your joy. You may not see it now, but it's in you. Success is in you. Breakthrough is in you. Victory is in you. Prosperity is in you. Whatever you are going through right now is the path that will lead you to the success you desire. But you have to fight for it. Don't give up. Don't give in. Fight, fight, fight and fight until the distractions can no longer stand you anymore. Until discouragement can no longer stand you anymore. Fight a good fight. Fight for your marriage. Fight for your love. Fight for your destiny. Fight for your prosperity. Fight for your children. Fight for your health. Fight for what you believe in. That is the way to go. Life is a battle. Those who fight without looking back are the ones who win in the battle of life. I remember the story of a British athlete who competed in the Olympics in Barcelona in the year 1992. His name is Derek Edmund. Derek Edmund. Derek Edmund pulled his achilles while he was running but refused to be stretched out. Refused to be stretched off. He kept wobbling, kept wobbling, kept wobbling, kept wobbling, kept wobbling until he reached the finish line. Because he understood that in life it's not all about winning, it's about finishing. Don't give up your dreams, don't give up your goal, don't give up your vision, don't give up your faith. Keep on fighting. Those who fight on in life always win. The Bible says, Weeping may endure for a night, but joy cometh in the morning. Do not be afraid to fight for what you believe in. With God on your side, you will overcome. Those who are not discouraged, who kept on fighting in the face of despair and hopelessness, are the ones who become conquerors. In the battle of life, you cannot retreat, you cannot surrender. You have to keep believing, you have to keep fighting, you have to keep going. Because this is your life. This is your vision. You need to keep fighting. And as you continue to fight, you will see God come true for you. God will bring people into your destiny that he has arranged for them to lead you through. Where you are weak. For he says, my strength is made perfect in your weakness. He says, let the sick say, I am well. Let the weak say, I am strong. Let the poor say, I am rich. Continue to see what you want to be and continue to speak it into existence. As you speak it into existence, continue to fight on. Make your environment enabling for your vision. Surround yourself with people who believe in you. Surround yourself with people who can encourage you. Surround yourself with people who are not toxic to your destiny. Surround yourself with people who will impact your life. Not everyone can be around you on your journey to destiny. You have to make the choice of who your friends are. 
on the journey path of destiny you cannot carry everyone along it's my prayer that as you fight on the lord will fight with you and you will overcome for victory is yours amen